Strengthening Sino-Indian economic relations will be top of Prime Minister Narendra Modi's agenda during his visit to China. Both countries have developed quickly and are keen to explore every opportunity in international trade and business. But how can these developments strengthen the bond between the two peoples and their remarkable cultures? He Weiwei reports. Mr. Bazdakia. An Indian businessman who came to China to seek his fortune in 1991 set up his first restaurant in Beijing seven years later. Now he is the owner of three restaurants in one of the city's most renowned business districts. After a difficult start, his restaurants are now attracting the steady stream of Chinese customers. It uh, started uh, slowly, then uh, it went on a peak when uh, we had 2008 Olympics. After that, it slowed down a bit, but now it has become steady now. Mm -hmm. In the very beginning, there were not many Chinese guests because uh, people were just getting used to foreign cuisines at that time. But uh, since 2005, the number of Chinese guests has improved a lot. And Mr. Bastagia believes the stronger economic relations between China and India have helped his business to flourish. Uh, the improvement on the business relations and economic ties. Between India and China are improving very, very fast. Very long before there was uh, just a minimal trade, not many people traveling. As far as uh, the barometer for us is the number of Indians which visit China, and who visit Beijing, and uh, the number of businessmen which are which are improving and uh, growing. And uh, lately, we can say that travel. A uh, lot of Indian travelers are coming to China because China is like a mysterious country to them. And they would love to see China. And with an increasing number of Indians now visiting the country, Chinese people seem to be more interested in learning about their culture. Zoe, who has been working as a yoga teacher for four years in Beijing, has noticed this development firsthand. Yoga originated from India and has a history of more than 2,000 years. For most Chinese people, yoga has always been a microcosm for India, as it inspires many of my students to travel there, to practice yoga for a few months. I think yoga is a very good way to find out more about India. As Zoe said, yoga is not just about promoting a good lifestyle, but is also a chance to bring two nations, such as China and India, closer together. Economic ties have been the most dynamic part of the China-India relationship, as China becoming one of India's biggest economic partners. And with the development of bilateral ties, the increasing exchanges in trade and business sector will bring more benefits to both countries. Kobe Wei, CCTV, Beijing.